Uh, tonight we have a proclamation to present from the office of the mayor of the city of Sheboygan. Whereas the public work services provided in our community are an integral part of our residents' everyday lives, and whereas the support of an understanding and informed citizenry is vital to the efficient operation of the public work systems and programs such as water, sewers, streets, highways, public buildings, and solid waste collection, and whereas the health and safety and comfort of this community greatly depends on these facilities and services, and whereas the quality and effectiveness of these facilities, as well as their planning, design, construction, are vitally dependent upon the efforts and skills of public works officials, and whereas the efficiency of qualified and dedicated personnel who staff public works departments is materially influenced by the people's attitude and understanding of the importance of the work that they perform. Now, therefore, I, Mike Vandersteen, Mayor of the City of Sheboygan, do hereby proclaim the week of May 17th through the 23rd of 2020 as National Public Works Week in the city of Sheboygan, and I call on all our residents and civic organizations to acquaint themselves with the issues involved with providing our public works, uh, to re recognize the contributions which public works officials make every day to our health, safety, comfort, and quality of life. Signed, Michael Vandersteen. And boy, this last uh, rainstorm, they really were out there working for us. I'd like to have David Beeble come up and present this to him. But while I have them up here, I'd like to also mention that the American Public Works Association has an award called the William J. Reinfrank Award, which recognizes a person or an organization that has had a far-reaching positive impact on the public works program, services, or policies through distinguished public service and commitment to their community in the state of Wisconsin. This award is named in honor of William Reinfrank, who was a president of the Wisconsin chapter in 1962, and he had a long career with the Milwaukee Public Works Department. Well, I was recently informed that by the American Public Works Association that David Beeble has been selected as a recipient of the 2020 William J. Reinfrank Award. The current plan is to formally present the award at the 2020 APWA Wisconsin Chapter Fall Conference to be held early in November. David Beeble has worked for the City of Sheboygan Public Works Department for over 30 years. Throughout his, his career, he has served as a steward. David is a highly dedicated professional who has consistently executed major projects that have benefited our community. He's an exceptional leader who knows how to motivate his staff to strive for excellence, as demonstrated recently with successful completion of the $10.5 million City of Sheboygan renovation of City Hall. David served as the construction project manager, working collaboratively with a local contractor and his staff. He has a rich history of serving the public through public works and serving on various committees, both public and private. From leading the successful development and implementing the city's stormwater utility, managing local DOT projects, to executing improvements to the city's traffic signal modernization system plan. David's expert knowledge and perseverance never fails to impress. The City Hall project was also recognized by this organization as the project of the year for the APWA Wisconsin chapter and has now been nominated for the national award. David, thank you so much for everything you've done for this community. Congratulations on the awards and here's the proclamation to keep as a small remembrance of this evening. Would you Appreciate like to say a few words? <laughs> Thank you, Mayor. Uh, it, it, it truly is a tremendous honor. The William J. Ryan Frank Award is a special award uh, at the state of Wisconsin, American Public Works Association. And I'm really humbled and glad to be uh, part of this and really to be recognized by my peers and to be uh, associated with so many past great award winners. As I mentioned, to be recognized uh, by the Public Works Association <laughs> Um, it's also an honor and privilege to serve the city of Sheboygan throughout my career. I'm grateful for the wonderful staff that has nominated me for this and their daily support that they provide to the community. As the mayor mentioned, this week is National Public Works Week. And what a great time to reflect on the accomplishments that our public works employees perform to the community. Each and every day, 
one of our public works employees, are really considered daily heroes in my mind. They are a critical part of our recovery during this pandemic, and too often the DPW, that the work we provide to the community goes unnoticed or unappreciated. In times of adversity, it gives me great pleasure in knowing that as public works employees, we are essential and are recognized for the important contributions we provide in improving the quality of life and keeping our community safe and clean. During this crisis, the department was able to execute and start up the automated garbage and recycling collection program as originally scheduled and without delay. This new program was crucial, not only to the safety of our employees, but the community as well. This program was one of the largest in the history of the department as it impacted approximately 18,300 residential properties. I wanna personally thank and recognize some individuals that were key in this project. Jason Blaziola, Superintendent of Streets and Sanitation. Dave Groves, Supervisor of Streets and Sanitation. Bruce Metzdorf, Super uh, Streets and Sanitation Lead. Andrew Bartell, the GIS Specialist Project. Don Sokolowski, Business Manager. Heather Burke and Melissa French, also of the business office. In closing, I just would really like to offer my sincere appreciation to the employees of the Public Works Department, but also to you, Mayor Vandersteen, for all your leadership and your support, along with the City Administrator, Daryl Hoffland, City Department heads, and lastly, the Common Council members for your all, all of your cooperation. All of us together share in these accomplishments, and it's a pleasure to serve the City of Sheboygan and to be part of the continued improvement of our great city. Thank you.